welcome back to my channel it's your boy louise for today's video we'll be doing hd curls updo so we'll be using a regular closure wig to do this hairstyle so now i'm going to get my got to be spray and my got to be gel and use it to push in her edges so after that i'm going to wear her my socks cap and then use a powder to tone the um, part where i'm going to have my wig on so then after that i'm going to wear the wig and then i'm going to take it up and use my control pins to hold it so after that i'm going to spray her hairline and then use the dryer to make it tacky then after that i'm going to place my wig and press it down so i'm trying to like give that frontal illusion or create the frontal illusion rather so then after that we'll be taking out the old part and then making a new one so i'm doing a c curve then after that i'm going to get my wax stick and then apply it on the hair so once i'm done i'm going to get my hot comb and then flatten that part So now guys this is the one i'll be using for my side sweep and mind you i am not going to spray this because it's going to be really stressful after everything when i am trying to like do the side sweep so i just go over and curl it without spraying so i'm going to be curling inwardly so i'm going to make like two curls on that part and then go over and section the hair before i start styling So now guys i'm going to take out um a part i seen in the video from the left and also from the right so i'm going to lift out one from the top because i'm going to be using it to create a bomb on the side so now i'm going to section the hair into three and then hold the middle one and get my bone So now before putting my bone i'm going to get my rubber band and then hold it down and then get my bone and secure it firmly so now this is like the foundation of this hairstyle and it needs to be really firm because um, once the bone is not sitting properly your hair is going to have a funny shape and let's say after doing all that and it's still having a funny shape all you need to do is just use your hands to So now I'll be getting my ultra hold spray because I want to start um, making the curls. So I'm going to section out little from that part I brought out earlier. So I'm going to spray judiciously and make sure all the flyaways are put together. So after that I'm going to comb it and after combing I'll get my curler and then start creating my curls.
so up next i'm going to take out the curl the curler and then start um clipping in my already curled hair so i did a video before where i used um, my fingers to like create curls so this is like um the same hairstyle but now the difference is um we're using our curler to like define the curls before um putting it on the bond so i'm going to be leaving a link up there so you can go watch it and compare and tell me in the comment section which one is more complex So guys, I'm going to be repeating the same step until I am able to cover my bone. So then after that, I'm going to use the one I took out on the left and on the right to create my curls and then paste it on the bone.
hitting the bump so now i'm going to comb my hair and then take out a little that i'll be using to like cover out the rough parts so i'll section out another one and then tease it so after teasing i'm going to spray it and then flip it over so the main reason why i tease this hair is because i want volume on that part i want a lump on that part so after that i'm going i'm going to cover it with the clean one i took out earlier and then brush it in from the surface then after that i'm going to get my combs to put it in and then form the shape so i'm going to be securing it down to hold it with my bobby pins
just tuning in hi my name is louis please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're yet to do that and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you always be notified whenever i post a video so if you like it here please stay i have a lot of amazing videos i'm going to leave a playlist up there so you can go watch my videos and please don't forget to share with your friends don't forget to like it and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment box thanks guys up next we're going to make our side sweep so for this first one i took it earlier i'm just going to sweep it in and then get my bobby pins and hold it down so after that i'm going to spray the hair comb it and repeat the same curling method i've been using earlier so then after that i'm going to like pin the hair down and make sure it's well secured So you guys were moving on to this other part you can decide to sweep it in and then you can decide to do like um this flip i'm doing here in this video so i'm just going to do the same curl and pin method so after that we're moving to the side sweep so this is like the complex um part in this um style most people are still finding it difficult but if you follow this step i used in this video trust me you're going to slay it when you're doing it for your client so now i'm going to get my wax stick and then apply a little on the hair and then um, brush it in so the reason why i'm doing this is to like control all the flyaways so you should be able to like control the hair not the hair controlling you so after that i'm going to use my rat tail comb to like lift it up and then get my um control pins so i will use my control pins to like hold it down on that part because i want it to be a bit high so after that i'm going to use my fingers to make So now we're going to be making the snake like side sweep so i used my fingers two of my fingers to hold it slanty so like i'm holding it in a slanty way so i'm going to like place it down and then get my control pin then hold it so after that i'm just going to comb it out and then continue and make um the same curls with the one i have on the tip so then after that i'm going to like get my um spray and then set the hair so guys i'll be using my got to be spray to set that part in front so it doesn't fall off so i'm going to spray judiciously and then get my comb and blend it in so we don't have white white particles on the hair
So guys, it's accessory time. So we'll be working with this headpiece from Uri's Culture. So like some brides will want to have their accessory on the forehead and some of them will just want it hidden behind. So, but we'll be putting this accessory um, behind like on the updo. So now I'm going to just place it on that part where I have my curls as seen in the video. So if you noticed earlier for the side sweep I did, I didn't use bobby pins to like hold that part down. So I'm going to like take the accessories in front and then press it down and get my bobby pins and hold it. So we're securing that part with one bobby pin. So we're doing like um, the hair and the accessories all with um, one pin. So after that, I'm going to do like finishing touches where i spray the hair and also voila we have it so i hope this video was really insightful and you really enjoyed it if you're yet to subscribe to my channel please don't forget to do that and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you always be notified whenever i post a video so i have a lot of amazing videos just go to my playlist and watch them and please don't forget to leave a comment so i'll see you guys in my next video Bye bye